The Pitt River Nation in uh, northern, far up northern California by Mount Shasta. We have a lake. It's called the Medicine Lake Highlands, and it's been a sacred uh, area since forever. And it, it's actually our healing waters that our people have used to heal. And uh, Calpines is trying to build a geothermal energy uh, reserve there, in which they're going to uh, add chemicals into the plates to get natural reactions. And in the process, they're going to destroy a very sacred place. Well, how do you feel about that, though? I mean, like, well, two words, two, yeah, two words. words. What's up, bro? Spir that, Spiritual genocide. Corporation who wants to build this uh, power plants right in this really beautiful, very sacred place to the native people who've lived there forever. Yeah. And so we're all here to tell Calpine, give it up. You're not building this thing. Calpine just lost in court. And so tribal members today are calling on Calpine to not appeal. That's them being outside all this morning. Uh, that's fine. Everybody's allowed their views. Unfortunately, we take a neutral stance in these things. We're just building management here, yeah. just making sure all the traffic flow goes in and out of the building. Oh, okay, make sure okay. it's a peaceful demonstration, which oh. by all means it has been. Chumi Sunwe. My name is Mark Lebeau. I'm a citizen of the Pit River Nation. I'm also an advocate for the protection of sacred sites. We're gathered here today to send Calpine Energy Corporation a message. That message is to cease and desist the building of geothermal power plants in the sacred Medicine Lake Sweet. Highlands. We hereby evict Calpine. Dear Robert P. May, Calpine CEO, over decades, Calpine has continued to cause harm to the sacred Medicine Lake Highlands. Your refusal to comply with the demands of the native and local community is in violation of your own quote unquote commitment to the highest ethical standards. Calpine Energy Corporation, you have lost your lease extension through the decision of the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals in November 2006. Therefore, Calpine Energy Corporation, we demand that you immediately the American people, you know, are sick and tired of, um, you know, energy companies, uh, you know, those corporations that, um, you know, you know, are able to, to to bend the ear of the federal government and get favors. I believe the American people are tired of having to pay, um, you know, their hard-earned dollars. You know, to support uh, Calpine proposes to drill for geothermal energy that will unearth mercury, arsenic, and other uh, material, minerals, heavy metals that are known to cause cancer. Uh, out of the, the spring-fed mountains of uh, Medicine Lake, uh, that water flows into Fall River, and then into Pitt River, and then into the Sacramento River and winds up in the South San Francisco Bay. We're talking about uh, hundreds of tons of, of mercury, a lot of arsenic uh, in the highlands, and they're put there for a purpose. You know, they're put there to, as an indicator to people, you know, to not not dig that deep into the earth. Um, you know, clearly, I mean, that, that is a message in and of itself. So that's a message. Uh, the eviction notice today, you know, that's another message. We're going to continue to, to send those types of messages to Calpine Energy Corporation. You know, this is just a taste. You know, we were here last year at this time. We had over 300 people here in protest. We're here again. We'll be here tomorrow. We'll be here forevermore as long as it takes, you know, to protect our sacred medicine lake uh, you know, forever. So, you guys gather every year around this 